Good day, everybody. My name is Dana Massa, and today I'm going to be answering a question that I get asked quite frequently. What is remote healing and how does it work? Well, one thing to remember that Einstein proved a very long time ago is we are energetic beings. So even though we look physical and we look solid, we are made up of energy. And secondly, remembering that we are energetic beings, we are a soul, and our physical is actually just our vehicle. So our soul is more comfortable operating and communicating in the energetic world versus the physical world. That is our natural state of being. Also to keep in mind, we have placed the limitations on us of time. So we have placed those limitations. We have created them. So really to connect remotely and really become well at it, you have to release those belief systems and come back to your natural belief systems that we are not bound by space and time. And something you can try out at home that's really easy to really test like, does remote healing really work? Is the other person really going to feel it? Talk to one of your friends, maybe someone that's also in the spiritual community. So maybe they'll be open to, you know, playing around with this is work on them, work on them just for five to 10 minutes, placing different colors in them, raising their vibration, maybe calling forth some angels, some guides that you work with to work with them. Um, also placing blesses on, blessings on them. So if there's something that you know that they're hoping for in their life, literally feel yourself infusing them with those blessings and then get some feedback from them and see what they felt during the session. Um, if you have any questions about re remote healing, though, definitely contact me at Dana at .com and check out my website, ascendyoursoul.com. And I hope to hear from you soon. Namaste.